I'm not a very good drinker. I'm your friend that if I have like three or more alcohols, I'm like, you don't even love me. <laughs> I'm not a manly man. I know I look like a quarterback, but inside I am all cheerleader. <laughs> Like, if I was strangling one of you, you'd be like, oh, your hands are so soft. <laughs> oh, death tickles. <laughs> I, uh, all I want is to be, like, more of a bad boy, right? Like, a real troublemaker, you know? But, like, look, at, look around this room. No woman in here right now is looking at me like, oh, man, I bet Pete would ravage me all night. <laughs> but there are women looking at me like, I bet Pete has good penmanship. <laughs> and I do. Here's what I'm like, have you ever been on your toilet, right, and your bathroom door is shut, and you're like, I am all alone, and then all of a sudden your cat's paw comes under the door. You know that moment where your cat's like, hey there, buddy. Why aren't we hanging out right now? I wanna hang out with you so bad. That's what I'm like with friendship. Yeah, I can be a bad boy though, ladies. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> like, I, I got into a tussle the other day. Yeah, I got into a tussle with one of those motion sensor sinks. <laughs> Do you guys tussle with that technology? That's the worst technology on the planet, because we're all intelligent people, at it, but it makes you feel stupid, because you're standing there waving your dumb hand, like, <laughs> how pale am I? <laughs> this thing's looking at my hand like, nah, that's just more sink. just judging my bone white ivory hand. I'm standing there waving my dumb hand, it's giving me no water, but motion sensor hand foam is like eerie, eerie. I'm here for you, buddy, eerie. I'm talking to it, I'm like, I can't use you yet, because I don't have water from your friend. Eerie, I'm like, ugh, paper towels are like mm -hmm. So what do you do? You try different hand motions, right? You're like, I'm gonna go really slow. I'm gonna go really fast, and I'm like, hey -ya! But then you finesse it like a little bit, and it rewards you, it's like squirt, you're like, oh. So that's what gets you going. Eerie, I was watching. <laughs> Me too. I, um, I have a girlfriend who's female. Um, yeah, woo, all right. Uh, we, uh, you know, here's the problem is um, I'm a feminist, I love women, I used to live in one. Um, but women don't want a feminist in the bedroom, right? They don't want that. They want a Viking that knows limits, you know? They want a psychic Viking, right? I don't know how to talk dirty in the bedroom. I'm like, yeah, do you like that? Do you like that? Okay, just checking. <laughs> the other night, my girlfriend, she goes, what do you want to do to me? And I was like, I'm gonna get you pregnant. <laughs> and then, you know, I'll just like be there for you. <laughs> when we first got together, she goes, what are you into? Like in the bedroom? And I was like, consent. <laughs> yeah. I have a huge consent fetish. Uh, I love consent so much. How much do I love it? Uh, I love consent so much, I don't even use those credit card chip readers until it tells me that I can't. Have you ever tried to put your card in too early? It's like, quack, quack, quack. I'm like, whoa, I'm not a bad guy. <laughs> I respect you. <laughs> But every single time, I'm just standing there all hesitant. The cashier's like, what are you doing? I'm like, I'm waiting for you to tell me that I can put it in. <laughs> every time, she's like, oh, let me do it. <laughs> all right, you guys, I'm Pete Lee. Thanks for being a great crowd. Thank you very much. <laughs>